number one customer request was for a cookbook. Not only a cookbook that had great recipes, but a cookbook that would work hand in hand with your Temptations dishes. This cookbook has 120 of my family recipes that I grew up eating, along with 50 full page color pictures. So when you bake that great dish, you'll know it looks exactly like what you see in the book. Look how easy the layout is and what makes it different from other cookbooks. I give you the cook time up at top, the prep time, how many it serves, and of course, what size Temptations dish to cook it in. Notice also in the body that you see the shopping list. It gives you a step-by-step -step of all the ingredients that you need, so you're not gonna be fishing through and inevitably forgetting something. Down at the bottom are my tips, which is a way to take my recipe, substitute it, and make it your recipe, or make it lighter, change the ingredients. It's super easy, there's a pantry list included on the inside, which is just gonna basically give you all of the spices and the staples that are included in all of these great recipes, and there's a color-coded index in the back, so it's easy to follow along, whether you're doing brunch, or poultries or meats or side dishes. It's easily laid out for you. Take a look at the table here. Here's one of my family favorites and at my holidays almost every year is my orange and honey glazed ham. Look how beautiful this is, presentation in your Temptations dish. Next to that, of course, let's do a salad. Because ceramic is gonna keep cold things cold, that salad is gonna stay nice and cold throughout the meal. That's my everything chopped salad. Next door to that is my fave, and that's my traditional macaroni and cheese. What I love about this is it doesn't start on the stovetop. It's done with dry pasta. Then you add the milk and the cheese and everything to make it yummy. It's super easy to make and tastes delicious. In front of that, of course, is my microwave peanut butter cup fudge. Because Temptations can go in the microwave, as well as the oven and the fridge and the freezer and the dishwasher, you can heat that chocolate. It'll get nice and soft. Have your dish ready, come right out of the microwave, put it right in there. That's just one of the tips that's included in the book as well. So we saw some of the savory, we saw the salads. How about the side dishes? Look at my creamed corn, my apricot glazed carrots, and of course, green beans with dried cherries and pecans. You'll notice in the back of the book there's a party planner section where I actually pull from each section to, to give you the perfect meal. This holiday meal is a perfect look at that. Take a look down in front, love this for appetizers, asparagus swizzle sticks. So easy, just take pizza dough, wrap it right around the asparagus and bake it. Look how gourmet that looks. Next door to that, of course, is another family favorite of mine, which is spinach pie. Because Temptations is ceramic, the heat's gonna hug your food. So that's why you get that gorgeous crust. There's no hot spots, and it's light and flaky on the inside. Another savory staple of ours was rosemary pork tenderloin. Look how beautiful this is. Not only can you prepare it in here, cook it in here, you can serve it in here. Any leftovers, snap that lid on, put it in the fridge or freezer. Tomorrow, you have another gourmet meal. Take a look right here, I saved the best for last. My triple chocolate brownies made from scratch. Now that may sound complicated, but not in Temptations. Super easy with three different chocolates. Look in front of that, white chocolate macadamia blondies, the perfect marriage between a brownie and a cookie. So whether it's lunch, dinner, dessert, appetizers, Temptations has got you covered. No matter what set you own, what pattern you own, you can create family memories from this book like I have.